This is the brick wall that runs along the front of my house. And like virtually every brick wall, it features weep holes. Weep holes typically present as a periodic absence of mortar between the vertical surfaces of adjacent bricks. Left unprotected, these holes allow more than ample room for mice to gain entry into a building. As you might imagine, there are a number of commercially available products designed to prevent this from happening. But being a frugal DIY type, I decided to repurpose some old wire mesh gutter guards instead. Now I happen to have a number of these lying around in my basement, but they can also be purchased at Home Depot for approximately $3 for a three foot length. While any portion of the gutter guard could be used to protect the weep holes, I opted to use the folded edge portion that's designed to lock into the gutter. To separate the section from the rest of the guard, I used an angle grinder with a cut wheel, riding the non-cutting side of the wheel along the folded edge as a guide. A bandsaw would also work really well for this. Next, I rough cut the pieces to length, which in my case was approximately the height of a brick. Some of the weep holes on this wall were relatively clean and clear. Others, however, had a bit of residual mortar. In most cases, this mortar was easily removed with a chisel or straight screwdriver and a mallet. If mortar obstructing the hole couldn't be easily removed, I simply trimmed the metal mesh to fit. The metal was then finger squeezed together to the point that it was just slightly wider than the weep hole. Doing this assures that the metal is under some tension and will fit and remain tightly seated in the hole. Once or twice, I accidentally compressed the metal too much. If this happens, a straight screwdriver can be used to re-expand it. With the metal mesh properly sized, a rubber mallet was then used to tap the pieces into place. Finally, I spray bombed the metal with an indoor-outdoor clear coat to protect the edges of the metal that had been cut. In retrospect, I probably should have done this prior to insertion into the weep holes. Now, mice are a tricky bunch, and they may very well gain access to my house through some means, but I can say with a high degree of confidence that it won't be through the weep holes.